At the very beginning, it's a bit shock. It's very lively and very active. Every night, we will be the same. You get to used to the condition. I enjoy it very much. My name is Isha Bin Sabah. I've been working uh, here since 1972. It's my first job. The main job scope is to ensure that our country has a safe supply of fish and marine products. At the same time, we got to attend to the food hygiene side. Now. Doing hygiene checks on the market, collecting samples for food safety testing, making sure that everyone is licensed to operate here. During the early 70s, there's a problem, we call it illegal trawling. There's a lot of challenges. You've got to work on board, going after them, you try to stop them. Or maybe we, when we set up, the weather is kind to you, it's nice to you. Then all of a sudden, in the middle of the sea, the weather change, rain, storm, challenge from the nature. Lah. In the past, the, the complex itself is only about 50% of the current complex. Now we have 110 stalls. Those days, because it started as an auctioning market, the auction will start at 3 a.m. The officers will start to ring the bell, giving signal that the auction can uh, proceed. So everybody have an equal chance of doing business. Uh. Per night, we have an average around 15 to 20 vessels from all nationalities, especially around the Asian region. Uh. From Malaysia, Thailand, Indonesia, Philippines. I think the most prominent problem is language problem. Most of the community here is speaking dialect. Okay, uh, Chun Kui Ho, your vessel was the number. Supposing Thai vessel, when they arrive, you got to ask them, Kun Che Alai, that means what's the name of your vessel? Ki Kun. Will be number of crew. Okay, Shashini. Apart from the language problem, is of course the odd shift. Uh, we have to face it. The first impression is the job is eight to five. You got to work on Sundays, on weekend, on holidays, night, day, you know, festive season. You have to go through. I consider myself lucky lah to get a soulmate which understand my problem, my job problem. Are willing to go along with it. Uh, already 45 years of my married life. I've got two sons and two daughters, three grandsons. Building up a family at that time was very the most challenging part. Have you ever thought of changing your job? Initially, yes. For the first few years, uh, the thought of changing job always played on my mind. Uh. But as uh, I move forward, I began to enjoy the working atmosphere, uh, camaraderie with my colleagues, and the sense of belonging. Over the years, there are many changes. One thing that have not changed over the years is our responsibility to ensure that the fish is safe for everyone to eat. I feel happy. Huh? I mean, we play a part in making uh, other people's life, enjoying their food, wherever, at home or at restaurant, safely. I've been here for 50 years, huh? so I'm looking forward to for my retirement, more time with my family. I spend more than half of my life here. I miss the people, the environment, the sight, the activities, all that. I miss the aroma of the fish. <laughs> After retirement, I will definitely miss Jurong Fishery Report.